So with Simon after the final home match, a 3-1 victory against Barrow, nice to sign off the home season with a, a win. Yeah, I was very pleased with the performance today and, and the result. You know, the result that takes and uh, it, was a, it was a good show. It was a good show, you know, three good goals. Um, and we, we started well. And I think that dictated the way we played for the rest of the game. The tempo was high and uh, we, we thoroughly deserved the win. Does an early goal always help? Because again, you know, we scored early through Anton, but do you think that put a bit of pressure on the team or, or not? No, no, I, I think a goal does help. Um, it settles people's excitement and nerves and um, gives you a, a good platform to, to play on and uh, to play with. And um, There's some e excellent individual performances, but the overall overriding thought for me is the, the collective spirit today was, was excellent. We, and we were energised in midfield through Alex and and Anton running the show and very pleased and the desire show shines through eventually um, when you've got players like that in your team. I say especially Alex as well because he started in from the beginning and he seemed to have such an impact on the game from an early start. Yeah well he's a little tiger in there isn't he and he's proved his worth this year you know when you, when you it, we loaned him out to Harry Good Railway and, and he was it, he's, he's been superb for them stand out superb and he deserved his chance and to be honest looking back he probably deserved it earlier uh, and that's my fault, but um, I, I thought he came as an 18-year-old and the last couple of games have shown a bright, uh, to be a bright spark and then today over 90 minutes, very proud of him. I went in again at half-time at 1-0, what did you say to the lads at half-time because they came out again a different side? Well, when you've got 11 players who are all of a similar mindset, it, it, you know, it, it doesn't take a rocket science, scientist to, uh, to get them going again. And we just said... Look, we're a bit sloppy for their goal. It's another set piece, three or four games that conceded from. We need to be better at that. Um, and but other than that, refreshing attitude. We loved it. You know, other than that, you've done well. They had a bit of a period, and they're a good team. You only have to look at their bench to know that they've got established stars there. Um, for for our part, you know, we've we've got a lot of young young players now that are coming through and doing well, and we the shape look good. Um, and we've got a good mix uh, and I was very pleased we probably deserved a lot more out of the game on Saturday but didn't get that things have probably gone against us today and it would be so easy for players to sulk and think well things haven't gone well for us um, the last game of the season you just see it through there wasn't that attitude at all they were well motivated and that's down to themselves and of course we, we went through and up through Ashley and Dan it was a lovely go by Dan Clayton as well yeah it took it really well he's so composed Liam did well to most of the build up played it uh, nicely through to him between the uh, the fullback and uh, centre half, and he, he finished it so calmly. Just at the time when I thought he was flagging, he proved me wrong and, and uh, finished it superbly well. But Dan's attitude since he's come back to the club has has been um, been there to be complimented. You know, he, he's, he's been superb. It seemed again that we considered another soft penalty, but Craig stepped up to the mark. Yeah, it's been a bad habit to get into. Really, we've conceded a few penalties recently. Um, it probably was, but uh, other than that, I think Matt Bloom was outstanding today. His heading was awesome, as it was at Ferriby. Um, Craig, fantastic save, so really pleased he got down well to his left very quickly. Uh, so well done him. Now, obviously, you'd be wanting to win again Stockport, but what else were you hoping the team can show you on a Saturday? Same again, really. There doesn't need to be any alterations to the lineup. Just go at him, start bright. Um, when we've done things quickly and, and made out the game be dictated by our tempo, then um, largely we've done very well this season. So we have to, that has to be the aim again on Saturday. Now we just had the end of season presentations and Adam Novakoski winning the supporters play of the play, play of the year season. You've got to be happy with that. Oh yeah, I mean Adam, it, it, you can see why supporters have uh, voted for him because of his wholehearted displays and sticks his head in where it hurts. Uh, that's why he's injured at the minute and. Um, in both areas, he, he's actually made a massive impact on the game, in the games he's played. So, very proud for him, and um, it, yeah, it, it means a lot to him, I'm sure, and also to me because you know, we tried to develop him and uh, give local lads a chance, and, and he's he's right on top of his game. And a special mention, obviously, to Ashley as well. He won the Players uh, Award, and you know, it, it seemed a, a very a very popular choice. I think so. You can see that with the with the audience there and the crowd in there that uh, like those two players. So a Ashley scored a, a fantastically uh, well taken goal today, uh, as he did on Saturday, and he's he's coming good. He's coming good. Not that he's ever been bad, but um, <laughs> I, I just think he's he's progressing all the time. You know, 
he's got fast feet and he's got a hunger and um, he likes to play for Harrogate Town, which is always a bonus. Will you be getting any lessons on uh, after after dinner speaking? His speech was a bit unique, especially the starting bit. Yeah, I don't know what that was about. I have to have a word <laughs> of pulling in. Might drop him for that, actually. <laughs> no, he, um, he's, he's one of the boys, you know, he's one of the boys and he's a young lad and um, he's up for it, so top man. That's great. Thank you very much, Thank Simon.